Today's workout is all about your arms. This stretch is called an upward salute. Start with your feet together and then take a big step forward with one leg. Lower the back knee gently down towards the ground and sweep your arms up overhead. As you do this, drive your hips forward and you're gonna feel this stretch all the way through the front side of your body and down into your hips. Hold for a few seconds and then switch to the other side. Ten seconds. I'm going to show you how to do an overhead tricep stretch. Bring one arm up by your ear, then bend your elbow, placing your fingertips between your shoulder blades. And take the opposite hand and gently pull your elbow towards your ear. And then you can press the back of your head into your forearm gently. You'll feel the stretch all the way down the back of your arm from the armpit to the elbow. Reach up and switch. Five seconds. I'm gonna show you how to do a speed bag exercise. This is a great upper body cardio exercise. Start with your feet a little wider than hips distance apart in an athletic stance, brace your core. Then bring your fists up right in front of your face and rotate one over the other and imagine you're punching a punching bag right in front of you. And then as you get comfortable with this, start to pick up the pace, careful not to knock yourself in the nose and you'll start to feel the burn in your shoulders and your arms. Ten seconds. I'm going to show you how to do tricep dips. Start by sitting on the ground, knees bent and toes pointing forward. Then bring your hands behind you, right underneath your shoulders, with your fingertips pointing towards your heels. Very important. Press up through the palms to lift your hips up off the floor. Bend your elbows backwards behind you and then squeeze the back of your arm to come to standing. You can also do these with your legs straight out in front of you if you like. Five reps. This exercise is called a chaturanga push-up. Start in a high plank position, shoulders over wrists, feet together on your toes in the back. Then lower yourself down to the mat, tucking your elbows in behind you. Sweep through, bringing your heart forward, and flip your toes, you get a little stretch here. Then tuck your toes back under, find your plank. All the way down, sweep through, flip your toes, stretch. Back to your plank, core engage. Make sure you lift your hips back up. If that's too hard, come down as low as you can. Rest at the bottom, dropping your hips to the floor. Give yourself a little stretch here. Come back down and push up to your plank. Ten seconds. I'm going to show you how to do cross punches. This is a great upper body cardio exercise. You'll start with your feet a little wider than hips distance apart. Soft bend in the knees, pull your abs in tight. Bring your fists up to your chin, block your face. Then cross over the opposite shoulder with your punch, bring it back in. So you want full extension through the knuckles and then snap it back in. And then if you want to pick it up, you can go faster. Abs tight, tiny rotation through the core. Five 
five seconds. This exercise is called up downs. You'll start in a low plank position on your forearms and then we're gonna press up onto your hands. It looks like this. The shoulders stacked over your elbows. Shoot your feet back behind you. Feet together is hardest. If you need a little more stability, you can separate them a little bit. And then from here, press up onto your hands. Make sure your nose stays in front of your middle finger and then come back down. So as you do this, you wanna try to minimize the rocking in the hips. So pull your belly in tight and use your legs too. Push, push, down, down. I'm gonna show you how to do a lying figure four stretch. Start by lying flat on your back, bend your knees, and then cross one ankle over your thigh and open your knee up so that you make a figure four position. Then take your hands and reach through your legs. So one hand reaches through, the other one comes around the outside, around your kneecap, and gently pull in towards your chest, keeping that kneecap pointing out to the side. And then if you need a deeper stretch, you can extend the other leg straight up for a true figure four shape and draw your toes towards your nose. Once you're finished, switch and stretch the other side. Five seconds left. 